Hey y'all, just got home uh, from the grocery store. I was going to show you what I got today and um, you know, I've got a few things to add to the pantry. Um, I spent, let's see, what did I spend? So you can see, $1.11.43 at Walmart. And I got this two, pa two pack of paper towels uh, just to put on the shelf. Didn't really need them at this point, but I will. So it was like two something. So I got those. Um, this big thing of cheese balls is for my son. He likes to snack on those. Uh, you'll you'll notice that most of this is for my youngest son because he is so picky. He's 15. Uh, he's kind of picky on what he eats, but let me tell you, the child eats like no other. Anyway, <laughs> cheese balls for him. Uh, a thing of Hershey syrup that's for Hunter. Um, two gallon of milk. A big thing of hot pockets. I know they're not the healthiest in the world, but you know, it is what it is. I got those um, again for Hunter. Um, a jug of vinegar. I'm a canner, so you got to keep that. Um, peanut butter. Some bananas. They're still green, so they'll last a few days. Um, package of cheese for a recipe I'm going to do later in the week. Um, five pounds of mozzarella. That is for some pizzas that Hunter likes after he gets home from school. Um, I did get two more of these cans of spaghetti sauce. I have, I don't know, maybe 12 in the pantry right now. <clears throat> and we actually like the taste of this. You know, if I don't make homemade, I, I use this. And um, these are on, what is it, rollback or something? They're usually a dollar, and I think they're like 82 cents or something like that. But hey, you know, every penny adds up, so I got them. I'm just going to throw them in the pantry. Um, I got some Walmart brand, you know, shake and bake. And some pizza sauce, pizza crust mix. I've got several of those. Um, you know, I do sometimes make it, you know, with yeast and all that, but when you've got a 15 year old that's hungry, he doesn't want to wait. So I just get this and we just go with it. Um, this I had a coupon for, a bell pepper. Um, I got these, I had a coupon for this. Roll of sausage, and then I don't know if you can see these are not little <laughs> pig corn holders. They were on clearance for I think a dollar fifty. Um, the Crystal Light lemonade mix. That's for my oldest son. Some ibuprofen. Uh, two things of alcohol. That's all for the pantry. Um, two things of Walmart Kleenex for the pantry. Some great value freezer bags. And actually that's all that I have here on the table that's from Walmart. But I did get a case of bottled water and four or five gallons of jug water. Four gallons it looks like on my receipt. All that came to $111.43. Um, you know a few of these things here are just to put back in the pantry. Uh, that I probably won't be using, you know, over the next two weeks. So I'll just put them in the pantry, save them for later, because I had a few extra dollars in the grocery budget that I wasn't going to use this week. Um, I usually go to the store every two weeks. Sometimes I do a fill-in in between. But this is what I got from Walmart, and um, I stopped at a couple other stores. So let me get this put away, and I'll show you what I got at the others. Here's another thing that uh, I got today. <coughs> uh, Mom and I stopped by a store uh, called Goodies, the department store. Um, I got these boots. They were on clearance and then uh, what they call it, doorbuster special, something like that. If you look, they were regular if it zooms in here or focuses. Yeah, it's not going to do it. $140. And then they were on clearance for 70 bucks. Well, the doorbuster sale 
they were $15. So I got a $140 pair of boots for $14.99 in tax. Um, <clears throat> I don't have all my groceries put away, but I'm going to show you these. Um, I live on a farm, so these will be perfect. Yeah, I have other boots that I'll slosh around in, but for $15, I couldn't pass these up. But, yeah, that's what they look like. And they're waterproof and insulated to 11 below, which it doesn't get that cold here in Kentucky, but yeah, I'm tickled to death with those. So hopefully the cold weather is over, hopefully for right now, so I'll put them up for next winter. But I just wanted to show you those and what a great deal I got on them. Very pleased with those. Okay, next up, I stopped at Food City. Um, you can see my amount, $34.88. And I got these Zesta crackers. These were buy one, get one free. So I bought four of those. Those will go in the pantry uh, just to stock. Um, this stuff right here is this pick five, they call it. You get five packs for 20 bucks. So I got two of these big packs of the uh, Cocktail Smokies. Um, two of these big, huge packs of pepperoni. And those are for the pizzas for Hunter after school. And then this uh, thing of ham. There's 24 ounces there. And I use that in uh, like a ham casserole, ham potato casserole, or omelets, stuff like that. So I got five of those, and that was $20. Uh, <clears throat> the Zesta ended up being, let me look on my receipt, $1.50 a piece, $1.49. And, uh, oh, and this was on Markdown. This is very lean, 93 937 is what that is and it was 332 um it was regular as you can see there not a 664 regular price so it's 332 so i got that and i also grabbed a bottle of diet pepsi and i had breakfast i bought breakfast there um because it was early and i was hungry so it's 34.88 for all of this and like i said the crackers will go in the pantry as stock um, and then the pepperoni and all that stuff that'll be eat probably over the next two weeks so Hunter will put that away for sure <laughs> but that's all on that one next I went to uh, the Dollar General I spent a total of twenty three fifty six with tax I had a total savings of let's see the receipt says fifteen ninety is what I saved. Um, all of this is for the pantry, just as stock. I got um, three 12 packs of toilet tissue. All I had was what I have in the bathroom. I was completely out of that in the pantry. Um, this pine saw, two things of laundry detergent, trash bags, uh, Clorox bleach, and some Clorox cleanup and Colgate toothpaste. Actually, that toothpaste ended up being 50 cents. So, that was awesome. Lastly, I stopped by Save a Lot and I picked up a few things. Um, I did get some Pepsi products. Uh, they had them four for ten dollars. Um, we drink these occasionally. Also, my other let's see at Walmart I got bottled water uh, we have juice some milk you know so we don't just drink this but we do occasionally drink it so anyway I got that um, I got a box of saltine crackers I know I got four boxes of zesta crackers from one of the other stores but my son likes these so I get those occasionally for him um, I got these four things of tomato juice um, to just stock in the pantry um, I'm pretty much out of tomato juice and stuff like that and it'll be a few months before 
you know, it's time to uh, get t tomatoes out of the garden. So I just bought this. I think this is like $1.49 for a big, <clears throat> a big can. Um, I also got three cans of sauerkraut. I have a bunch of uh, 50 some quarts, I believe, of uh, home canned sauerkraut. But, you know, some of these stores have these things like this marked down if they're damaged or dented. So <clears throat> I got those. They were marked down. And uh, my total for Save a Lot was $19.92. So with all the groceries that I got today and the stuff from the dollar store, I spent right at $190. That's not counting the $15 on the boots. Um, mo most of this is stock for the pantry. You know, some of it we'll eat in the, over the next two weeks, but a lot of it's just to put back that I caught on sale or, you know, marked down or whatever. But that's what I got right now. And tomorrow, um, I still have a little bit left over out of my grocery budget. <clears throat> and tomorrow, one of the grocery stores um, is doing a Friday stock up sale. There's a couple things I'm going to stop by and get there. I have to go into town anyway, so I'll do that. And if in the background of any of these videos you see stuff like that on my wall, <laughs> don't worry. We are uh, in the middle of, well, we're getting ready to repaint my dining and kitchen area. So that's just where my husband had patched the walls. But anyway, um, if you enjoyed this video, please like, subscribe, share, and um, I'll have another one coming up here in a few days. Hope you enjoyed.